center of gravity. The center of gravity is at the geometric center of a body if the body has a uniform mass. That means usually the center of gravity is located at the center of the object. For example, if you have a ball, the center of gravity will be at the middle of the box also. If we have uh, some water inside the empty sphere, then the center will be lower. Okay, now, so this is the position of the center of gravity, and it is also the point that the gravitational attractive force acting on it. So that's why when we draw the force diagram, usually we add a small cross at the middle to show the center of gravity and the weight is acting on that point. Now, what is the use of it? Now, for example, you can see that there's a weight and a normal reaction. When the weight is not pointing at the normal reaction, it will form a left moment, so the object will turn. In order to achieve an equilibrium, the weight and the normal reaction must be along the same line in order to achieve the equilibrium. So when we learn the center of gravity, we are looking for an object to see whether it's equilibrium or not. Now the left one, you can see that the weight is not on the same line with the normal reaction, so it will turn. The other one will turn on the other side. Only when the weight is at the position along the center of gravity, along the weight, it can support in equilibrium and not falling to any side. And you should note that sometimes the center of gravity of a body may not be inside a body. Okay, here are two examples.